can feel you in my head, in my veins. I know you're there, but you don't believe me with every word I say. So it's a little after eight and we are at the shop because I am gagging for a monster man. Like I am screaming inside for some caffeine. So this is a full day of eating. So you saw for the first meal, I had hundred grams of oats and them oats I have, I think they're flavy. I don't know what, they start with an F. They're slightly more expensive, but oh my God, they literally smoke any other oats. They are so fucking good, man. So hundred grams of them. And then I have three whole eggs as well. And I have like a cup of raspberry. So I'm heading to the gym in a little bit, which means it's time for my pre-workout meal which is very simple i literally have two of these squares bars packed full of carbs they're easy to eat i have two of them and if there's some of you guys that struggle with appetite these things fucking perfect like they're so easy to eat so you just have two of these so having two of these is literally 300 calories so let's get these down us and head to the gym boy Unfortunately, they only had the green one. But the green one's still pretty good if you've never had it. Got the DMB blaring. We are at the gym. Time to fucking kill it. And you just don't care. So can't you the fire fire burns like a warning light that shines us right to the end of the night before you know. So we're back from the gym, so it's post-workout meal, very, very important meal. So we've got 100 grams of cereal, 250 mil of egg whites for our protein. So after you train, you always want to get your protein on, obviously, and you want to get your carbs. So you want to get, like, a cereal, but you want a fast-release carbs. So you don't want oats or anything like that. You want, like, a cereal, you want a potato. Something's going to release very quickly. People always forget that when you're in the gym, you just burn up, like, a ridiculous amount of carbs. So the meal you eat straight after the gym should be packed. Anyway, I'm starving, so, so I'm going to finish this off in about three and a half seconds flat. Oh, what a day. Mate, it is so hot today. Like, my bollocks are literally having an aneurysm. So I was at the gym the other day, and I randomly just banged out a muscle-up, and I've never done one of them in my life. I'm at the park, and I'm going to see if I can do one on that. Yeah, let's just zoom it in a little bit. Right, are you ready for this? Bruh. 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 Mate, look at the sky. To think this is the UK. We've been having like insane weather at the minute in the UK. It is so fucking hot. Out enjoying the nice weather with the missus. Sheesh. Mate, the weather is too nice not to enjoy it. It is unbelievable. It's so nice that I'm wearing a vest without a pump. And I don't usually do that because, you know, hashtag body dysmorphia. And also, it, just, it doesn't feel right wearing a vest outside of the gym, does it? Those of you that wear a vest in the gym, it doesn't feel right, does it? Not at all. Oi, what are you doing, bro? Just found a cricket ball in the middle of the fields. Whoa. A bit of shit there. So I've got to be careful. It's like a minefield of shit. Yeah, I found a cricket ball in a field and I'm not even joking, yeah? The cricket pitch is all the way over there, like literally like a mile that way. So someone must have really like batted the life out of this for me to find it here. My dog Holly, yeah, it's just so odd. Like every other dog, yeah, if he threw a ball, she'd run and get it. Watch this. Holly, Holly, what's this? <laughs> If you're trying to bulk and you hate cooking, like I literally hate cooking, then this is gonna change your life. So I bought this air fryer probably like three months ago. And I promise, this thing alone has been the number one thing that's changed my life. Like the best investment I've ever made. I, th I think it costs like 40 quid and I got it on deal. But if you're gonna get it new, I think it's like 60, but still 60 quid and I can cook all my food in there. So I've just taken out the Mediterranean veg and I did the chicken earlier. It's approximately 250 grams of chicken. I don't even know how much veg there is. Let's probably say 75 grams. And I'm gonna have this meal twice with some jasmine rice. Honestly, if you're still eating basmati rice, switch over to the dark side. 
I promise you, this rice will change your life. So much better. So these two are my favorite meals to go to in bulk in. Honestly, so cheap. Like you can get a kilo of chicken for a fiver. The veg is like two quid for like a kilo of that as well. And I think one of these sashes of rice is like 60p. So it will work out to something like less than two pound a meal, which is such a bargain. You can season up the chicken, then you can put some salt and pepper on top of it. It just makes it taste unbelievable. So I'll eat them as the day goes on. Probably with a few hours in between. These meals are just super convenient. I can take them to work with me. Uh, I work at the gym, so you know I can sit there, stick it in the microwave a minute, minute and a half, and you've got a banging meal right there, which is packed full of calories, nutrients, and carbs. I like, like to fight. So a lot of people on my Instagram wonder like what I do day to day. So I work at the gym. I do online coaching with like a few people, like only a really small group at the moment. And then I also trade Forex. So for most of the day, that's what I'm getting up to. There's a small trade I had running earlier on GJ. As you can see, we're really nicely in profit. If you are interested in any of the Forex stuff, then just shoot me a DM and I'm, I'm literally free to help you out. I just don't want to be one of them guys on Instagram that's like renting a Lambo and like wearing a Rolex and being like, oh, look how much die I'm making because it, it, it's literally not even like that. But if you guys want me to talk more about it, let me know in the comments below. So, it is... The oh, fuck? It is much, much later and I need to get... Final meal in before we hit the hay, because I am shattered. And once again, we are having 100 grams of oats. Now, I have these last thing before I go to bed, because I train early in the morning. So I actually have some carbs in my body tomorrow morning that I've actually digested, that I can use. Because oats are actually a slow release carb, so you want to be having them hours before you train, otherwise you're not actually making use of the carbs. Oh, God, 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 God. 